What do I feel like it's cold today? I feel like, I don't know if it's because this blind is closed, but like, I feel like it's a little cold today. It's only 79 in my house, my, it's Fahrenheit, which is like not in the 80s, which is like cold for me. So hopefully that helps the situation. Good morning, I woke up at 11.30, which is way earlier than I've been waking up and I forced myself even though I was tired, I was like shut up and wake up. Last night I was so productive, I plan to stay true to that again today. Today I'm actually doing something really exciting. Charlize, like from Mad Max, that actress, uh, her and her team have invited me to like this intimate dinner conversation about what we can do to help the AIDS. AIDS epidemic, so that's really cool. Uh, I'm gonna get to meet her and have a really meaningful discussion about how to make the world a better place. That's where I'm going tonight, uh, but to, for right now, for, have you noticed on the first minute of my vlog, I can't speak English? In the first minute, I'm just like, <laughs> but I'm gonna do some work, and then in the evening, that's what I'm doing, I'm going to that dinner. Um, and that's what's crack a lacking. Yesterday was about, Options. Let's see what today is about. Uh, and I've <laughs> the cards fell everywhere. Many, many, many. Are these new cards? Are these old cards? Oh, I think these are old, new cards. The cards are out of order. No. Okay. Today is about. Picked up two. God damn it. Today is about no judgment. Honestly, I feel like I need to make a version of these cards for myself because, like, I feel like I have something to say about all these things as well. But also, these are the exact things I would say. Maybe I should endorse this company and, like, invest. Anyways, no judgment. I release myself from any and all judgments. Oh my God, I have a story about this in a second. I find my inner critic. I find my inner critic call it to my office and tell it to take a vacation. As it leaves the room, I let out a sigh and begin to enjoy <laughs> the joy of being, the joy of be, simply being. Who hired that guy anyways? First of all, let's talk about two things. I can't read. Mostly because anytime I read these cards, I had just taken my Invisalign out every morning and I'm just like, but this one is about no judgment, releasing yourself from all judgments, finding your inner critic, calling it to your office and telling it to take a vacation. Um, I think this is really important because I, this actually really resonates with me. The other day when I was, like two vlogs ago when I was feeling like a little bit out of it and sad and like lonely, I actually meditated for a while. And uh, my version of meditation, like I don't follow any way to do it. I just do it my own way. I light my candle, I sit there, I close. I light my candle, I sit there and I say things to myself out loud that I need to hear. And one of the things I was talking about is judgment. I was upset about a lot of situations and I was repeating to myself over and over again, like you are not in the position, don't have the right to judge a lot of these people in situations. And I was repeating that to myself over and over again. That made me feel so much happier, letting go of that judgment, letting go of just of that desire to look at certain situations and be like, oh, well, it's because this person's like this and this person wants this. And just like stripping all that away and seeing a situation for what it really is. So, so important. If you let go of judgment, you'll be such a happier person. Um, but that's what's crack lacking. Swike here, bro. Why are you standing here reading this when you could be working? And she said, just kidding, please stop working and sleep. Never, let's get to work. Being mad productive all over again. I'm having a creative, you know what it is? For those two video ideas I have that I can't tell you what they're about yet, I'm putting no limit on my brain of how crazy they can be. So one of the ideas I thought of is like so crazy, like it's gonna be so expensive and so impossible to do, but I wanna do it. So I'm planning to just hire a bunch of people and be like, please make this happen. I really wanna do this. Um, but I just had like a creative moment right now which I thought of some dope-ish, so I'm very excited about that. But I'm about to start getting ready to head to this dinner with Charlize and I need to figure out what to wear. Hmm, hmm. Welcome to this episode of Lily is trying to dress herself. So <laughs> this is what I'm wearing. Um, it's like an army green cute dress thing with these silver shoes and then we'll wear a black blazer on top. And I got this little necklace, I got my bows. This is the vibes, this is the vibes. Like, you know, it's supposed to be like business cash, so you know, I'm like, what else? Do my thing, cute little dress, little blazer. Hopefully, kinda, I don't know how to dress myself. <laughs> but I kinda learned how to do my lipstick. Huh, 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 huh? All right, I'm at a stop sign, so hopefully I don't get to go soon because the camera's gonna fall. But, so I'm headed to this dinner and I've never been to anything like this before. It's like an intimate, uh, conversation about you know, social causes. This one's about AIDS. Um, Charlize is hosting it. And why are you honking at me when there's so many cars coming? I don't understand. Um, and I've never been to it, so I'm just starting to learn a lot and kind of experience things. You know what I mean? 
I'm never gonna be able to turn here. Never! Dracarys, fly! Hola! Okay, let me just preface this with no amount of words I say right now are gonna express how phenomenal that dinner was. It was so inspirational, so wonderful. I've never been to anything like that and I had no idea what to expect. It was literally a group of 20-ish people that just had great ideas and came from all different walks of life and we talked about HIV AIDS. And um, it was just phenomenal. First of all, Charlize is so passionate about it, which was great to see. And it was a really just intelligent conversation about what we can do. And to be honest, I learned a lot. I don't know a lot about HIV at all. Like I never learned about it in school. I haven't had any conversations about it. I learned so much and I felt so inspired to tell you all about the things. First of all, number one, and I feel almost stupid saying this, and even when I heard this today, I was like, what? Did you know that HIV is completely preventable, but it's still like the second leading cause in North America, the number one leading cause in Africa of deaths between, uh, amongst adolescents? I had no idea. I don't know if I've just been living under a rock. I had no idea that it was completely preventable, but it's still killing so many people. And statistically, 37 million people on the planet have HIV. Like, are HIV positive? Like, I just don't understand. I just don't, I just, I just, I just don't understand. I just don't understand. So like, I am committed. I've committed now to learning more about this and doing what I can, whether it's sharing this information with you, telling you ways that you can get involved in conversations as long as we just have some open communication going here. Um, because you're Team Super. And Team Super changes the world for the better. And this is just one phenomenal way we're gonna change the world for the better. Um, Charlize is wonderful afterwards. It was just so overwhelming because when I see someone like Charlize, someone that I was like, holy crap, you're amazing at what you do. Like, she's a phenomenal actress and I loved, I, I love watching her on the big screen. I'm mesmerized by her. So for her to come up to me and be like, Lily, I'm such a big fan and I'm baffled by what you do. It's like, what? You baffled by me, girl? I'm baffled by you, though. You ba- you, 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 I'm baffled by you. What you even talking about? So it was just like so great. Um, we're definitely gonna do something together. We're gonna think of some girl love, some Jen Ended stuff. Jen Ended is the hashtag that she promotes um, to end the epidemic. And it's just like, I'm gonna commit myself to giving myself a crash course and learning about this and sharing this information with you. It was so Wonderful. The two things I can tell you right off the bat, and this is coming from a place of genuine passion um, that has been sparked, is that, dude, we gotta change the world a lot of ways. One is that, like, yo, you know, one of the biggest problems is with epidemics and a lot of things, whether it's rape culture or anything, it's that taboo associated with talking about sex in our cultures. And trust me, I know when I said that, half of you probably cringe because just like me, you might have grown up in a culture that, like, people don't talk about sex. And that's kind of a problem. And even me, you know me, you know I don't know a lot about sex. Come on, you already know. You know I'll keep it real with you. Okay, I don't. But I do know that when you do it, you gotta be safe. And these things need to be discussed. And parents need to talk to their kids. And kids need to talk to each other. And the conversation needs to be started. So um, that's all I'm gonna say for today. But just something to think about of how Team Super is gonna help change the world. And it's gonna be through things like this. And so shout out Charlize. Um, Jen ended. I'm gonna talk more about this later. And just... We're in this together. That's what's up. Yo, the time is 1.34, getting mad work done. I'm almost done for the night, then I'm gonna head to bed. Um, I'm obsessed with sticky notes. I'm not gonna show you because a lot of them say things that are kind of top secret, but like there's sticky notes everywhere on my desk. I'll show you a quick flash, ready? Nah, I don't want to, it's risky. There's some pretty bold stuff over there. Nah, nah, uh, nah. That boss lip is still looking perfect though, just saying. <laughs> Toilet talk. There's popcorn stuck in my teeth because I had popcorn just now and it was delicious. It was a small bag and it was light, but it was, it was delicious. Delicious. I'm gonna head to bed. Um, I haven't decided if I'm gonna watch an app. I might read or I might watch an episode. I haven't decided yet, but I don't wanna go to sleep too late, that's for sure. Tomorrow, Nargis, okay, am I saying her name right? God, am I saying her name right? It's not Nargis. I know you say Nargis, it's Nargis. Nargis is here. Uh, I'm taking her to a screening of Bad Moms, which is the Mila Kunis movie I'm in. I'm literally in it for like, 10 seconds, but still I'm taking her to a screening of that in the morning and then I have a call for some girl love stuff and then tomorrow I'm getting a lap dance from Yusuf.
I'll see how that goes. I'm kind of terrified. And I've texted him many times being like, yo, if you prank me, we, like, I'll stop being your friend. I'll straight up stop being your friend. So you better not prank me. Um, but that's what's going on. For now, I go to sleep. I love you so much. And then I also, another thing, I was looking at comments from yesterday's vlog and so many people are like, I skipped the part where she look, looks at the cards on the fridge and I'm just like, that's the best part. Well, I don't know. I like that part of my day. Comment below and let me know. Am I just boring you all with that? Or do you also like the affirmation cards? Um, but yeah. <laughs> if you like it, subscribe. If you like it, subscribe. If you like it, subscribe. Yeah. I'm just leaving on tour soon and I made up my bucket list item. Uh, have you announced a tour? Uh, so Lindsay says. <laughs> I'm going to Europe this spring. She's going to Europe this spring. And I've made my bucket list item that on one of Lindsay's international tour dates, I'm going to fly to wherever she is and watch her show in some part of Europe or somewhere. And I insisted that she has to stay mm. and stay on the tour bus with us for at least a couple days. And I've been Let's show them how we feel about it. Our, our facial okay. reaction, right? One, two, three. <gasps>